What's going on, Shady People? Shady Penguin here. Welcome you back to the next episode of our Minecraft Hardcore Survival Series. Today, uh, we have some things to take care of. My goodness, do we have some things to take care of. Our number one... Oh my gosh, I'm going to have to organize this stuff very soon. This is getting out of control. Out of control. Oh, we have another chest. Let's throw this down real quick. Uh, we, we have a number of things that I would like to take care of. We'll get rid of this book for now, this potato. We have, there's, there's a, there's a lot. There is honestly a lot. You guys have been filling me up with information, with tips, with tricks, with, with, with tricky tips. Just a lot, a lot of different things that I would really like to, I'd like to tackle it all at once, but that's not how we're going to do things here. How we're going to do things instead is we are going to, at the very, very first thing we're going to do, I'm probably going to take a majority of today's episode, if I'm honest, is I really want to make myself a turtle farm. Not a turtle farm, I'm sorry, a turtle tank. I would love to make a turtle tank today in our episode. And in my mind, a turtle tank has glass. A turtle tank has sand. And a turtle tank has water. So all of those things need to be in place for a true turtle tank. We're actually going to use this as our, just our stone chest because there's just so much stone that we have. So that means that I should have glass somewhere. I do have some glass. I might actually have to cook some more sand, uh, some more uh, glass for this now that I'm thinking about it. All right, let's just do this. One, two. No, that's not what I want to do. One. No. How do I just select one? Why, game? Why do you got to do this and make this so hard for a nub like me? Okay. Bam. Do you have another stack of sand? I don't think I do. I do have another stack of sand. Okay. After all that, you better believe that we're going to... We're going to do the darn thing. No, stop it. Stop it. There's got to be a way that I'm just not knowing how to select one after playing Minecraft for 17 years. Okay. So I want to build... Where's our, first of all, first of all, first of all, where is our turtle? Where did we land? Where did we land? Okay. Our turtle's here. Okay. So I think I would like our turtle's uh, tank to be over here. Now, I have no idea how glass interacts with water yet. So what we're going to do is I'm going to place glass block here. Okay. That's a very good sign. This makes me extremely happy right now. So my goal is to build a literal tank for my turtle. Uh, and I'm just going to quickly think about... First of all, we got... Oh my gosh. it's already. I love how every time we start another day, it's always nighttime. I feel like this is not the right way for me to do this. Okay, let's go take a nap. Let's go take a nap because clearly I need it. Clearly I need it. So my goal is to create a genuine turtle tank. Now, I hopefully I still have even more sand because I need to put sand in there. It's probably not going to be the world's largest turtle tank just yet. But eventually, I think I've decided that our turtle who I don't know. What should we name our turtle? I kind of want to name him Timothy. I kind of want to name him Tim. Tim the turtle? Tim? Yes. I like the name Tim for Tim the Turtle. So I want the tank to be made out of glass because I want it to be see-through. I want them to feel like they have a lot of ocean floor to go to when, when I mean, truthfully, they're, they're, they're not going to. Unfortunately, there's nothing I could do about that. Uh, and I'm, I'm, I don't want to overestimate how large we can make this tank yet because we don't have that much glass. But even if, the, even if only one wall is truly made of glass, then that's fine with me. But I just want to give them a little bit, just a... And I say they because we are going to get more turtles. I already know we are. We're definitely getting more turtles. Uh, it's just a matter of when. No! Dang, what a waste. Glass, I don't think there's any way to actually get back. Unless maybe there's a certain enchantment that'll let you do it. But as of now, I don't think so. Okay. So here we go. We have a nice little, this, this little baby turtle tank. We're going to start building it up. This is, oh, actually I should have, uh, it's okay. Let's go ahead and build it on the outside if I can snag that corner. Perfect. Okay. Because I want them to have a little, I want them to have a little bit of wiggle room. Especially like, you know, he's going to be looking for a mate. Going to bring, bring a mate in here for Tim. Uh, Tim really, uh, you know, Tim really, really wants to have a sizable, sizable home. To, to, to maybe, maybe, maybe he's going to want a family someday. You know, this might not be his forever home, but at least something, some sort of home that's genuine. Okay. Turtle tank has started. Uh, I don't know how high we have to go. I don't know if turtles can jump at all. Really not sure. But we're definitely going to need more glass. 
I really want it to be see-through. So that's why we're going with glass. Some of you guys said I could just put up a fence. Uh, oh, that, that, this, this corner doesn't matter anymore, does it? Sorry. Sorry, that sound is so sad to me. Okay, so now the question is, uh, how do I get the turtle in here? Uh, did I bunk up, dude? Can I not get the turtle in there? Oh, no. Should I have built it, like, just into the water? Oh, no. I think I, I think I should have built the tank around Tim. I think I should have built the tank around Tim the turtle. Oh, boy. Uh, I'm in for a sad time, I think. I'm pretty sure I'm in for a sad time. Uh, I really think I'm in for a sad time. Oh, we might have just wasted all that glass. Okay. Let's recap. Or let's run around and think. Let's think. How can we get this turtle in there? I don't have a lead. We can't drag him in there. I also didn't really make a way for me to bring... Can I, like... Can I... I can't hop with the boat, right? No. You can't hop with the boat. Okay, so I really think that I'm gonna have to... Uh, break this glass. Did I make a... I didn't make a whole floor, though, right? There's hope... Oh, no, I did make a whole floor. I definitely did make an entire floor. Okay, well, we don't have to break the entire floor. Even though we kind of do. No, because they can... They can climb up on sand, right? I'm hoping... I'm hoping they can climb up a little bit. Okay. Let's break these two. Oh, it's sound. Why don't I use my pickaxe or something? Will that be any faster? Okay. Oh my gosh, this this boat is so speedy. It's going Mach 7 right now. Okay. We have it in here. It's actually kind of satisfying breaking the glass. Maybe an axe does it better. Shovel? Sword. Okay. Regardless. Okay. The turtle is in the center. The turtle is in the center of this place. Okay? Now, I need to build the floor beneath it, actually. Because I can't have the turtle escaping. Are we gonna have to go this deep? Okay, this might have to be the way we do the floor. Come up for some air. Cool. Oh man, we're gonna need so much more glass than I expected. This is like, this is actually high level, high level Minecrafting for someone so new. Honestly, I think, I think I'm biting off more than I could chew. I genuinely believe so. Cause now if I don't want him to escape, I need to build this all the way up, don't I? This wall needs to come all the way up. It does. It definitely does. At least, at least glass is made of a, a plentiful resource such as sand. And look, we just got more sand. Great. Fantastic. Okay. So. The tank is starting to take shape. Uh, we're going to need one here. You know, building in water feels really cool. I don't know why. I really like it. How, mu how much further did I come out? What was I thinking? How large of a tank was I making for these, for this, for this Tim? Okay, that piece of glass is wasted. All right, let's get out of here. Oh, I just want you to have your own turtle tank. Is that so much? Is that too much to ask? I don't think it is. Probably gonna need to cook way more sand now. You need to cook way more sand. Let's see. How much sand? How much glass we got? We got another 20. Oh, actually, we should be okay. Wait, why are you getting thrown away? Thank you. Okay. I think we can build this turtle tank. I am I am of the belief that we will build it. The turtles will come, and it will be a good time. This is gonna be one of the more methodic. Or re and relaxing episodes of Minecraft, I think. I probably don't need to put a cover on it, but I guess if I want to protect them, if I want it to be a real tank, I'm going to cover it, right? Okay. Let's not worry about the corner anymore. Because I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. So, this is actually not going to be the floor anymore. So all of this glass, we get to break. Not that one, though. Okay. And we're gonna leave a little spot of water. So like, we're gonna save some glass right now. 
It's shattering glass is so weird because it kind of looks like I don't know. Kind of looks like it shouldn't be. It, it's not even there. Okay, I need to crouch and crawl under here. I can't. Am I trapped in here right now? Uh, jumping over. Oh, come on, bro. Come on, bro. Do I have? All right, good. We could just put a little sand pile here temporarily. Okay. So let's finish closing this up. This is going to be, this is the floor we've decided, right? This is the floor. Okay. I've definitely bit, I definitely bit off way more than I can chew. For certain. There's no doubt in my mind now. Okay. Can't leave a hole. Okay. There's no hole. Don't think there's a hole. So let's hop in there real quick with him. Okay. It's got some water. This is holy right here. But I want like that to be our, yeah. Yes, exactly. Okay, Steve, Tim, Tim. Tim, I need to get in there with you. Thank you. Thank you, Tim, for not hogging. Cool. I need, I need to put it, no, not, not back there. I need to put one right here. Yes, yes. Oh, placing glass is so weird. I wonder how many of you guys are tilting right now. If you're getting tilted, hit that like button. Okay. Oh, just that sound is tilting. Okay. Got a giant box. That's not the floor, right? No. I luckily put more floor. Cool. All right. Now I don't. This was this was my outer wall that I placed, isn't it? Why don't I make the wall? You know what? It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Actually, this is fine. Put this here. I'm okay with this because this can be our sandbar. Actually, I want that to just be the sandbar. Can I just, well, regardless, I think is everything covered. Is there a wall here? I can't tell. I can't tell. I'm too scared to let Tim out without knowing. I need to make sure there's no, there's a wall actually here. There isn't. See, I knew it. Tim would have swam away so fast. Okay, so now we have one of the most ugly looking tanks in the world. So much excess glass. Uh, but you know what? It's our ugly looking tank. Gosh darn it. Look at this piece of glass. What is this? What is this piece of glass doing? Absolutely nothing. It's getting shattered. But I think we successfully built somewhat of a tank. Let's go ahead and grab some of this sand. Because we're going to need more sand for Tim. I think Tim likes water and sand. He's not just a he's not just a water turtle. He's a, he's a little bit of a sand guy. A little bit of a sand guy. So I'm going to make sand steps for me to get out. And then we're going to make this little sand bar here. I'm going to put sand right here. Okay. Got a little sand bar. Not as much swimming space as I would have liked, if I'm honest with you. Uh, I would have liked a little more swimming space for him, but... Now the question is, how can I get, I want to get the boat without hurting Tim. Oh, I just broke glass. You've got to be kidding me. Here we go. I got the boat. Where did Tim just go? Tim, Tim hopped up on the sand. Heck yes, Tim. Oh my goodness. Tim loves the sand. Okay. We're going to give Tim more sand. He seems like he enjoys sand more than water. All right. Uh, I should probably light this place up and we got to put a top on it. We got to put a top on our turtle tank and that only took us half the episode. We did it. Oh gosh, I thought it was going to take us longer. I don't know what else I'm going to do today. Uh, what else could we do? What else could we do? I uh, was not prepared for this. You know what I could do? I could make an anvil. Okay, we got more glass, thankfully. The top of our tank. But if, I, if the only problem with putting a top on is that I can't get in there with him then. What happens when I want to hang out with Tim? What I'm, I'm going to put a, I'm going to put a piece here because it's really tilting me seeing that. I'm just going to do that. I don't care. Okay. Tim's got a little water. He's got a little sand. Am I really going to put a top on this little guy? I wish it was wider. He's only got one strip of one strip of water and then one strip of sand. I feel bad for Tim now. I really do. I kind of want more water in there. 
I want there to be more water for him. I feel like that. I feel like there's not enough water. We're gonna put one piece of sand right here as well, so I can hop up. Yeah. So this is gonna be friendly. To, you know what? We're not putting a top on it. We're not putting a top. I'll lay some torches. I can't. I can't put a torch on glass. Wait. Why did that? Why did that happen? I didn't want that to happen. Okay. I can't put a torch on top of glass. I want this to be lit up so at night he's just got romantic mood lighting. Or whenever we do find Tim a little mate. Uh, we want more water sources. Yes, we do. Okay. Give me my third bucket as well. And you know what? I'm pretty proud of this. Being my first... Ah! Being my first, like, out of the box, inside of a box, building thing. I'm pretty happy about it. Not gonna lie. No, nope, I wanted to actually put water there, but okay. okay. This should be infinite, right? Yeah, that's infinite. Okay. So now we should be able to just dump more water wherever we please. I almost like, now he's got a little water slide going into this little tiny pond. There we go. That's more what I was looking for. Thank you. There we go. Okay. Now Tim's living large. Like now, look at this. Now Tim has a nice pool right beside. He can go down a little bit. Uh, and we could always like, if we want to make, we could just go deeper with this. We can make this a really tall aquarium in the future, but I'm not gonna put a ceiling on it. We're gonna let Tim have uh, the breathing room that he needs. I'm not like enemies are gonna spawn over here because he's got torches. They could walk over here. And look, during all of our adventuring, our uh, sugarcane farm. Okay, now let's see. Can I make a glass? You know how you can make a, what was it? A panel, not a panel, a slab. Can you make a glass slab? What was that thing called? What was this? Pressure plate. Okay, pressure plates. No, 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 no. Uh, it was like, I guess because I don't have the stuff with me right now. Did you put carpet over the water? I don't think so. Book and quill. I just don't have enough, I don't have enough of like ingredients on me right now to actually check out what I can and can't build. So when you harvest this, you like to leave the bottom one. I think everyone told me, oh my sugar cane is going to fall into the water all the time, isn't it? So just at eye level, if you pretty much do this. Should get a ton, a ton of sugar cane. And I don't really want to leave it lounging around. I love that I can actually jump on sugar cane and not have to worry. Uh, chances are that I destroyed some of the farm. Yeah, it looks like I did. Okay, I destroyed some of the farm for sure. We're gonna have to replant. Nope, that's not what we wanted. Gonna have to replant. I was trying to not do the bottom, but I'm really bad at this whole crafting mines thing. So I destroyed some of the farm, but it looks like we're pretty good. Only, only a couple over here. Here we go. Fantastic. Okay. So now that's done. We got our sugar, got our cane. We can make probably a butt ton of paper, uh, but I don't really know the process of making books, but I know that's the whole point. You guys wanted me to harvest paper was to get books. The other thing I would love to do today would be to get a cow. I would love to find an area with cows because apparently cows are like the next big thing I need between food and then uh, more than food. Because once we get cows, then we can take an episode and make like a full fledged farm. We got carrots we can plant, which growing carrots is going to be great. Carrots are super important. Uh, we have bones. Maybe I'll keep my bones with me in case we find some uh, some people we can tend to. We have sticks, we have torches right now. We can get rid of our glass for now. We'll keep our boat, keep our smithing table. We're gonna equip our shield again, just by clicking F. And I'm gonna keep my buckets with me in case we come across lava. I think that's everything I wanted to do. That's everything I really want. Oh, you know what I wanted to check? What did I want to check? Oh, how to make a book. Oh yeah, give me my, give my sugar cane back. Give me this back real quick. Okay. We're gonna see book. How do you make a book? A book is leather and three pieces of paper. Okay. Bookshelf is three books. Okay, so you gotta go book, you gotta go book into bookshelf. So you gotta go paper. So how do you make paper? Paper is just this. So this is very easy to make. So we can do like, I think we need, what would we need? 45 papers? We do that. I don't know if that's correct, but we're gonna see. Book. Book is three papers. So if we need, if we need, 
I think someone told me we need 15 or five bookshelves. We need 15 books, which means we need 45 papers. Okay, so we have enough paper. Paper, check. Now we need 15 leather. We already had paper. Shh. shh, shh. Uh, really quick, apparently to make an anvil, we need this. We need a block of iron. If I take this block of iron, we should get new recipes, and now we should be able to look up anvil. Anvil. We need three blocks of iron. So let's go ahead, block of iron. Two. We only need two more. So bam. Now let's go anvil. Awesome. We got our first anvil. I don't really know what an anvil is for. It's something with naming. Okay. Repair and name. So we should be able to name our diamond, right? I think we can name our diamond. I don't know how to make name tags. Like the, the item that the, where you hang an item. I don't even know what the item is called. So you guys have to let me know. Can I just... Can I just name this my first diamond? I did it! So my first diamond! Okay! So we, we, we have it named, that's awesome. Now we just need to get a picture frame for it and hang it up. Because we're not using that diamond. We're gonna go ahead, it's gonna be like your first dollar bill when you when you have a, uh, an establishment and what have you and it gets hung up. Okay, so my goal right now is to find a cow. How quick do you think we can find a cow? What plane of existence do cows live on? That's the real question. Okay, well it's definitely right about 57, 57. We have our coordinates down packed. We know how to get home now pretty easily. We, oh, you guys have been saying, oh, oh, you've been lost, you've been lost, but I haven't really ever been lost, lost. I've just been like filling the void with some conversation while I'm looking for where to go. Okay, I would think that a cow would exist on like a farmy land-based biome. I don't know exactly what that would look like. I don't know if I've ever even seen a cow. I'm trying to think. I know we've seen pigs. Look, there's pigs right there. We've seen pigs. Okay, pigs are gonna be pretty easy to get back with us then. And there's also a table here that I left. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, that's a lily pad. Since we don't know how to, since we can't, I wanted to build glass panes for our farm, but lily pads work as well. Okay, get out of here. I'll take this back. We can very easily get pigs whenever we want. They're very close to us, that's great. But our mission today was for cow. Because cows make leather, cows make milk. Cows are great. So pigs live in the swamp. Is that a Shrek joke? Is that a shot at Shrek Minecraft? I feel like it is. I don't feel I don't feel very happy about that. Uh, apparently, me, the dark oak that I want for flooring is like one of the harder woods to find. Apparently, it's in like a dangerous biome, like a heavy, thick, dark wooded biome. But is this dark wood right here? I think this is dark wood right here. This looks pretty dark to me. This looks like I mean, this looks like it'll make good flooring no matter what, even if this is. Even if this isn't the one that I was thinking of, it, it, it looks pretty good. So I'm, I think I'm gonna rock, look at this. Let's see what kind of oak this is. Is that dark oak? It's dark oak. Dude, this is what we want for the flooring of our new home. Or when we upgrade our current home. Some of you guys are saying, I don't know why you're gonna destroy your current home. Just use it as a base of operations, like a farmhouse or something. And I agree with that. We're not, we're not gonna destroy it anymore. But then someone else suggested, why don't you just like slowly upgrade it instead of trying to do it all at once? Like, First do the floor one day, then build, then replace the walls. And I was like, oh, you know what? I actually like the way that, I like that thought. That mentality is nice. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and try to remove all of this wood. Uh, but we're gonna need some dirt to do that apparently. We're gonna have to build a little dirt tower. Let's throw our dirt here. We're not gonna be using lily pads frequently. Katie, weren't you looking for a cow today? I was, I am. But now there's the dark wood that I was literally raving about last episode. So how am I supposed to not capitalize on this find? And I was just saying that you guys said that the dark wood was going to be difficult to find or dangerous to find rather. You guys didn't say difficult. You said dangerous. But I don't feel like I'm in danger. <laughs> I'm in danger. I don't I don't feel that way right now. Okay, apparently I can't think. Okay. Okay. Can we reach? Can we reach? Oh boy. That's yes. We can reach. You gotta get rid of all the bark so that these trees start dwindling. Ow. Surprised I'm not hungry. Is it already nighttime again? Dude, our like, our days are going so fast. So fast. It's insane. These trees are so thick. You get so much wood from them. It's kind of crazy. 
I think I'm actually going to put my torches in my left hand for now. Does it give a- oh, it doesn't give off any light. I thought maybe it would give off a little light. Okay, let's go to sleep right now before things get dicey. Okay, before any enemies spawn near us, because it is pretty dark, let's go ahead and go to sleep. Oh my gosh, this episode went so fast. If you made it all the way to the end of this episode, give me a little uh, tiddly wink in the comments. That's T-I-D-D-L-E-E-W-I-N-K. Tiddly wink. Because uh, if you made it this far, this episode was like super... I mean, it feels productive to me. But someone said the other day when we caught Steve that it wasn't a productive episode. And I was like, we caught a turtle. What are you talking about? Unproductive. Like, what? So, I want to see how many of you guys feel that way. And if you made it this far, that means it was a pretty... First of all, it's a productive episode if you made it this far. So, that's automatically a win. Uh, I really cannot believe how long I could honestly play Minecraft for so long and just have no worries and no hurries. Someone said it best in the comments. It's a very, like, it's a very calming game. It's very, like, not stress relieving because I don't feel that stressed right now in life. But, like, I don't know, man. It's such a nice change of pace compared to the other games I play. Because, I mean, this can be stressful. It's, it, there's some str stuff that can happen in Minecraft that is stressful. We've screamed a couple times. We've screamed. Are those leaves going to stay? No, they're going to start dissipating. Okay, cool. Awesome. All right. Let's tr let's really try to find this cow, man. Let's really see if we can find a cow. I have no idea if a cow... I mean, this looks like a place a cow would live. Don't you think? Or does it need to be more green? It might need to be more green. But there's sheep here, so who knows? Where did my boat go? Am I, am I back in the boat? My boat was just glitching out. I love how you can just punch your boat repeatedly. It'll never break, but then you pull out a sharp weapon. I mean, it makes perfect sense. The boat's dead. But I feel like I feel like a punch should a couple punches should do the trick as well. Okay, we ate that bread, gamers. Oh, uh, we're back in the desert. There's not going to be cows in the desert. I'm I'm like I'm smart enough to know that. I'm definitely smart enough to know there's no cows in the desert. Watch, I guarantee you there's cows in the desert because I said it like that. I'll make a lull. Oh, uh, where can I find cows? Uh, this stuff is important, apparently. Whatever these roots are, they're 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 pretty pivotal to something. I might have to settle for a pig, man. I might have to get oinkers back in the game. Cows must be pretty rare. Cows must be pretty rare. I love these giant mushrooms. Oh my gosh, I thought the dark wood was gonna be hard to find. We have an infinite supply of it. We have an infinite supply of it. We can make whatever we want with this dark wood. Uh, we have a little chamber over here. A little chamber. So many, so much wood, dude. This is insanity. I cannot believe how much dark, and because the, the trees are so thick. They're so thick. Oh, this really looked like a cowy place to me. No idea what biome cows spawn in. I mean, I genuinely think it would be like grasslands. These are dark woods, so we should head towards grasslands. There's just so much desert by us. All of these mushrooms. Oh my goodness. Look, this looks like a home for gra for cows. Right here. This wide open space. Super cow-like to me. Super duper cow-like. You didn't finish your bread. You gotta finish your bread, dude. Oh <gasps> Yes! Cows, baby! Let's go! Let's go! Bro, what's up? Bro, get in the boat. Yes. Get in the boat. No idea which way we got ahead yet, but we are gonna get there. 497. Okay, I think we're going the wrong way right now. Oh, no, we're going the right way. We're going the right way. Kind of. Kind of going the right way. We gotta go west. Here we go. Oh, man. Okay, we're going the wrong way. We're going the wrong way. We're going the wrong way. Okay, this way's the right way. Oh, my gosh, this cow. I just gotta find a waterway out of here. Hopefully, all waters lead to the ocean. Because if not, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Oh, no. What am I supposed to do now? What am I supposed to do? I don't know either, dude. No! 
I'm just trying to hit the boat, not you. No, 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 no. We're friends, we're friends, we're friends. We're friends. Shh. shh. Okay. You know what? We're going to wrap this one up here because I need to get my bearings and then figure out how the heck I'm going to get a cow all the way home from here. Because we are pretty far away and we have, let's find what direction we have to head in first. Okay, the numbers are going down on the X axis. The numbers are going up on the Y axis. Okay, this is the direction home. This way. So we need to head all the way through there with a cow. No idea how to do it. You guys gotta let me know in the comments down below if a boat is really gonna be plausible to, to ride all the way through. I don't think so. So we need another mode of transportation. Uh, with that, I'm gonna get the hashtag out of here. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. If you did, please don't forget to show some shady love to that thumbs up down below and hit subscribe if you haven't already. Have yourselves a fantastic day, but above all else, keep it shady.